Hey everybody, welcome to Tokyo Swan for this week. Uh, here I am with Irene again. Hi, partner in crime. The partner in crime again for this week, and we're at Odaiba, which is a giant man-made island here in Tokyo with lots of shopping and fun stuff. So Irene, what's what are we what are we doing here today? Alright, it's another scorcher of a day, yeah. but First on our list, we're gonna go head up, hit up uh, Fuji Television's headquarters, mm -hmm. and then we're probably gonna shop around Dex, mm -hmm. maybe check out Sega um, the Game Center, and then we're gonna head off and see the large Ferris wheel on the other side of Dino. So it sounds like fun, and we hope you enjoy the episode. <laughs> so Irene, where are we? Where are we? Oh, we're at a cat store. <laughs> a cat fanatics. A cat I mean, fanatics. I love cats. Yeah. And it seems like more like a supply pet food shop. Mm. Like, yeah. Else. I've never seen so much cat merchandise. Yeah, me neither. It's kind of scary. Yeah. yeah. I don't want to become like one of those creepy old women with like 20 cats in her house. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the ocean. Yep. And then we got something else that also reminds me of America. We'll uh -huh. see you in a little bit. I'll see you in a little. Oh. Forward to it. Okay. <laughs> and here it is. The Statue, Statue of Liberty. And Welcome Japan. to New York. Cool. So now we're at the Fuji Televi. Um, headquarters or whatever, and we're going up this cool like escalator. Escalator. Yes. Hey. Hey. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Oh yeah. Hey hey hey. Uh, yeah. This is hey hey hey. Yeah. yeah. One of the few shows I know. Yeah? Oh. So here we are in Fuji Televis. Like, it's like a tour of like their studios or whatever. Um, I don't really know too many Japanese shows, but I'm kind of familiar with some of these variety ones. Uh, Irene, your thoughts? Uh, I watch Japanese dramas, so yeah. I was into that. It was cool seeing like, their sets and stuff. Yeah. But... So you know a few of these then? <laughs> I don't think I appreciate it quite as much as Japanese people would. Yeah. So this is where it all happens. All the strange and wonderful Japanese TV shows. We actually could see them filming some of them downstairs, which is kind of neat, but they didn't allow like filming of that. But even though I don't understand what 90% of this stuff is, or probably 95%, uh, it's interesting. And now, Irene, where's the next stop? Next song. Yep. Uh, Big Ferris wheel. Big Ferris wheel. Ooh. Yep. Sounds fun. Irene, where are we going right now? Take a wild guess. Take a wild guess. <laughs> Presenting food in Odaiba. Now first, this is what I've got. Some chicken curry thing. Irene? Hi. What, are, what, are, what did you get today? Korean food. Oh. Bimba, which is like, it's mixed Korean rice and then some like really spicy mochi stuff. Mm. The puzzles. I love jigsaw puzzles. I'm a nerd. You're a nerd. Oh, ooh, a Gundam one. That's cool. All right.
right, so we're heading over to the Giant Ferris wheel location, but as you can see in the background, it looks like it may rain. Okay, so we just heard thunder. And we saw lightning. And we saw lightning. This could potentially be a very disastrous ending to our adventure. So, I think we need to get an umbrella or get inside. I'm prepared. Oh. Hooray. <laughs> Irene brought an umbrella and I am... Um... No, of course not. I don't think these things out. Tokyo Swan. All right, so we'll see. Maybe it won't rain. Maybe it's just a false alarm, right? False alarm? Hopefully. 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 What? I'm prepared. I'm prepared. Okay. It's like a disaster movie, so I feel like I'm in Hollywood or something. I like it. Oh. Thunder. <laughs> Thunder, lightning. Yeah, I feel like. Yeah, like in a movie? What? Yeah, yeah. seriously. What a fitting day for. <laughs> Whoa, it's right. Ah. Oh, oh. Alright, so here we are in the thunderstorm. <laughs> seriously, it came out of nowhere. Yeah. We're trying to protect Irene's umbrella. Tokyo weather is insane. Yeah. It's so predictable. <laughs> <laughs> disaster! Disaster! <laughs> um. Okay. Uh, oh, that's so cool. <laughs> is that cool? Oh, I feel like I'm in a movie. This is cool. This is cool. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, so... We're pretty drenched. Oh my goodness. I'm uh, pretty drenched. This is. <laughs> There's not a single dry spot left on me. <laughs> nope. Dude, Japanese people have like a sixth sense when it comes to rain. It's not like a horde of them just like running for the nearest like supermarket. Uh, yeah. Like, yeah, and then two seconds later, sure enough, sure enough. this happened. Uh, so now we're under a bridge. <laughs> yeah. I did that because <laughs> it's, it's pretty much pointless at this point. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Might as well not be wearing shoes. <laughs> Let's go swimming. Let's go swimming, yeah. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah. My gosh, can you believe this? Does it sound like it's clearing up? Um, a little bit? Maybe. Look at that! Yeah. It stopped raining completely. Yep. Squish, 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 squish. So where are we now? We're at the water's edge. The water's uh, edge. Next to the Statue of Liberty. Oh yeah. We're drying off. Oh it's yeah. Nice. It's all <laughs> like hot and muggy again. Yeah. So that's Tokyo Swan for the week. It was a great time in Odaiba with Irene and I wanted to dedicate this episode to her because she's been an amazing friend to me this past semester and I feel so lucky to have met her and to have gotten to spend time with her. She's really just a fantastic person in every sense of the word so Thanks a lot, Irene, and I hope you enjoyed the episode. Anyways, I guess that's it for me for this week, so we'll see you next time.